My message is simple. This council supports hard-working taxpayers. This council has always believed in finding the best value from every pound. And this council has reviewed every service we deliver, making £329 million worth of savings over the past five years. But what this council cannot do is stop demographic pressures beyond our control. This council needs government to recognise that higher demand leads to higher costs. That's why this council needs a fairer funding settlement now. That's why it's absolutely vital that the government spending review in the autumn takes into account the demand pressures on local government. And that's why I will keep making our case to the Secretary of State and anyone else who will listen week in, week out. Of course, in these times of reduced public finance, if we are to fully meet the demographic pressures upon us, devolution is vital. The Cities and Local Government Bill announcement was an important step in that direction, meaning that devolution to counties is now firmly on the table, something that I have fought tirelessly for as the Chairman of the County Council Network. Surrey residents must not miss out on this opportunity to have a greater say what happens in their county. I have been working with partners such as the leaders of our district and borough councils, as well as the leaders of East and West Sussex councils, to establish just how we could work together so government can, can allow us to make more decisions at a local level for local people.